So to get started, I'd love if you could tell me about the, uh, the terms training data and testing data in the context of machine learning. Yeah, absolutely. So training data generally will refer to the portion of the data that a machine learning algorithm uses to learn patterns. So for example, the parameters of a logistic regression album, uh, algorithm rather can be chosen such that the error is minimized on the training set. The testing set is a data that is not seen by the actual algorithm and is used purely to uh, gauge the algorithm's performance. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that makes sense, right? Because you don't want to um, gauge the model's performance on the same data that it was trained on. So what I'm curious about then is uh, you mentioned that you want to minimize the error on the training data set. What if though your algorithm involves like parameters that you need to tune? So for example, like the number of layers or like the size of your neural network or a uh, learning rate. Um, if you need to tune those parameters, uh, do you tune it on the training data? Like what do you do instead? Yeah, so generally those are called hyperparameters. And so what people will typically do is take out a portion of the training data and call it a validation set. And then they will tune those hyperparameters to maximize the performance on the validation set. Okay, perfect. So now you have training data set and a validation data set. And uh, so then again, which data set do you actually evaluate the final model on? Typically you will evaluate it on your test data set at the final okay. step. Um, usually you should only be using your validation set to tune these hyperparameters, but you should kind of have a, this holdout set that uh, never has any information that is used to inform uh, the learning of the actual algorithm as well okay. as the hyperparameters. Perfect. 